Hola chicas! Right, today I'm going to give you a little talk about phase two. It's very exciting. So, where do we begin? I've made lots of notes. This time it seems to be pretty straightforward. All right, we've had some trouble trying to understand. Oh, I'm dropping my bloody notes. Right, to begin with, walking. Walking all time slots have been eliminated so we can walk at any time of the day if you're an adult, at any time, anywhere, as far as you'd like to go. But there is one little rule about this. Firstly, if you're in a public place and you cannot avoid the two meter distance, then it is compulsory to wear uh, a mask. Secondly, we are still keeping an, an allotted time period for the elderly, the over 70s. So the rule is to avoid going out between 10 and 12 in the morning and between 7, 8 and the evening. So those two time slots are specifically for the 70s or over. Every, uh, the rest of the day is for everybody. And children still need to go out with an adult. All right, uh, next thing is the thing that everybody's been waiting for is when do the beaches open? When do the pools open? Well, the beach is open on Monday and so do the pools. Uh, pools will obviously be down to the actual individual place who, who the, the pool belongs to, whether they are, are ready to open it or not. But um, beaches are going to be opening. They're going to be opening between 10 in the morning and 6 in the evening and they're only going to be opening to uh, a capacity of what was it quickly look at my notes very professional where have i written it beaches will be open but they're going to be heavily regulated and all the rules are going to have to apply and obviously everybody's going to have to wear masks on the beach uh, um, no idea how strict they will be on these rules Again, that depends which region you're in. And obviously you have to bring all your own stuff um, and you can't use the showers or, or any of the public facilities. But also they're not all opening, so I'm just gonna let you know which. So in Arona, I'll tell you, in Arona, you'll be pleased to know that the beaches that are gonna be opened are Los Cristianos, Las Vistas and Las Galletas. So, and then in um, Adeje, it's going to be uh, La Enramada, which I've never even been to before, and uh, Playa Fañave. And then everything else is basically just gradually opening up. So all the terraces, the terraces stay at 50% capacity. Can't remember even, I've already forgotten what capacity they were at phase one, but now phase two, 50% capacity. All the shops are now allowed to open, but they also have to be at a 40% capacity. All the shopping malls are allowed to be opened. Again, they're restricted by their capacities. The malls, I never know how to pronounce that word. And common areas will still remain closed. Hotels, in phase one, hotels were allowed to open up 100% of their capacity. Obviously, there was nobody to actually come to them. But with all the common areas closed, 100%. Now that has changed. Uh, common areas of hotels and tourist accommodation are now allowed to be opened, but to a what percent? What percent? What percent are they up to? Let's have a look. 30% capacity for public areas. Churches have opened. Thank goodness, we're all allowed to go and have our freedom, our rights to worship, have been restored. Again, uh, that would be capacity of 50%. So we're gradually having our rights returned to us. Um, obviously, the right to uh, not wear a mask has, has uh, not been given us. We'll see where that goes. So, so it's going to be a fun day on Monday. It's going to be a fun day. But you might have noticed that I've got a completely different look today. It was just one of those straight hair days. You should have seen it the other day. It was a complete fuzzball. But today it's straight. So. I hope this has been helpful. Let me know if it has. And uh, oh, I wanted to tell you, I got recognized on the street the other day as the girl who's on, not the girl, okay, don't flatter yourself, Anna, as the woman um, who's on um, YouTube. Like I said before in one of my previous um, 
videos, I know two people on this island. And somebody actually stopped me on the street and said, they recognize me off YouTube. People know me, but I don't know anybody. I want to integrate and I am learning Spanish. I have a Spanish lesson twice a week. One day I'll give you a little demonstration of how badly I'm doing. Right, folks, I shall see you all soon. Bye-bye.